Ayun. Hello, what's up guys? Yan. So, ako nga pala po si Coach Justin Manharis. Yan. So, may bago na naman po tayong ano, Bible story. Yan. So, eto, kilala, kilala po ito ng mga Christians at Katoliko. Uh, eto po si Jonah, yung ano tao dun, yung isa-save niya po yung Nineveh sa ano, sa distraction na gagawin po ni God kung hindi po sila sumunod sa utos ni God. Yan. So, eto po si Jonah, kakainin po siya na sana po siya ng ano ng big fish pero 3 days later po um eto ano po siya tawag din lubabas na po siya sa ano dito sa ano dito sa butas dito na well sabi daw nose po yun eh. okay guys so ah uh, eto babasahin ko na po yung the big fish okay so guys so eto po yung pinagkopyahan ko po tapos eto na magbabasa na po tayo 51 the big fish the book of jana Jonah was sinking under the water. He went deeper and deeper and deeper into the sea. He saw a big shadow approaching right under him from the depths of the sea. It came closer and closer. It was a big whale that came and swallowed Jonah alive. It swallowed him in one mouthful. Jonah went all the way down to the belly of the enormous creature. It was dark and smelled terrible inside. There, all the time, a lot of fish, oysters, and crabs, and more that the whale was eating flushed down to the belly of the whale and surrounded Jana. Though it was a scary dark place to be inside, to be the belly of the whale, deep down below the sea, Jana knew that God still could hear him. So, he started to pray to God. Jana prayed for three days and nights. Nineveh is saved. God had not forgotten Jana. All this time, Jana was praying to God while he was swimming, swimming toward land. W what? One on the third day, the and guys, so ginamit ako po siya ng color marker, tapos ano color pencil rin, tapos ah, uh, eto kaya ako po tapinilin e drawing kasi natatawa po ako yung ano big whale, ganto lang kalaki kumpara sa tao, kasi ano, tapos mahilig rin po ako sa sea creatures kasi ano, nabilib na bilib po ako kung paano sila nakakaano paano sila nakakahinga sa tubing hindi kagaya sa ating tao pero na, ano, naintindihan ko na kasi kaya po sila nakakalangoy kasi meron po silang gills pero ang nakakapagtaka naman sa whales bakit ano, bakit wala po silang gills yung ano dito, yung parang ganun yung sa shark at fish pero, na-explain na po ng mga scientists na ano, nakakahinga po ang mga whales po sa tubig dahil meron po silang nose dito or nostrils. So guys, so yan, so ito po yung ating Bible story natin for today, yan. So, uh, sana may, ano, sana may natutunan po kayo sa ating Bible story. Uh, sana may, ano, sana, um, ayun.